What is going on guys? Welcome back to Bioshock Infinite. We'll continue where we left off in the last one. So, loot. No, not loot. Uh, I guess we're boarding the airship. I'm guessing this is probably where the uh, loading screen is going to happen. <laughs> More than likely. Money, 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 money. Yes. Want to hold on to this? Sure. Thank you. She found more. Great. Okay, so we've got another one of these. Where do we want to go? Um, you know what? I'm gonna upgrade the health at least by two, and then we'll do shield again. It nice. seems like we're in a little bit low on health, and I'm guessing this is more than likely where the loading screen is. I should probably really include this into last episode, but hey. I've included it on this one. Right, well, uh, just need to use, I think. Okay, this is where we finally leave this area. Are we ready to say goodbye? I'm ready to say goodbye. Let's go. You alright? I want to see Paris. There you go, achievement. I want to see everything. It's up to you now. There's no one. Wait, what is that? 40 north by 74 west. That's not Paris, that's New York. How did you know that? One thing I had in that tower was time, Mr. DeWitt. Time to study things like geography. I owed money, and there's a fellow, he offered to wipe away my debt in exchange for you. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on, everything's gonna be okay. Will you just turn around and talk to me and we can- <laughs> You sort of deserved that. Just... Just a little bit. Shouldn't have tried to deceive her, man. You should have just told her outright. She just be honest with her, do it. She's smarter than she looks. Man, she must have hit him hard. Oh. Okay, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Hello there. Always. Fresh air did the trick. This one's awake. So you're this false shepherd we've been hearing so much about. Caused a mess of trouble after raffle. You Fitzroy? Nothing but. I got no quarrel with you or your Vox Populi. This is my airship you're hanging me out of. And I got perilous need of it. Really? Cause it sure look like old Comstock's airship to Listen, me. I ain't looking for a fight. There's already a fight to win. Only question is, which side you on? Comstock is the god of the white man, the rich man, the pitiless man. But if you believe in common folk, then join the fox. If you believe in the righteous folk, then join I the just fox. Want my ship. And the vox shall give her to you. But first, you must help the vox. Down in Finkton. As a gunsmith can supply weapons to our cause. Get our guns from him, and you shall have your ship back. Cheers. I'll go get your guns. Okay, so we haven't got Elizabeth right now. Yeah. I'm supposed to go that way, but let's go in here. Hopefully this music ain't all copyrighted. Hey there. How are you doing? Let's see what we've got in this vendor machine. And... We don't have enough money. <laughs> 
Everything seems to be fairly cheap here, right? Let's uh, grab this and listen to this. Sammy will always thought that the pew on Sunday went hand in hand with the desk on Monday. Science is the slow revelation of God's blueprint. After two years in the Lamb's Tower on Monument Island, he took ill with cancer of the stomach. I prayed to the prophet, and the prophet delivered unto us a miracle through his servant, Fink. I do not know if I will ever get used to a husband bound in a skeleton of metal, but better a handyman than a dead one. Okay, I don't remember this bit. Um, from the game. I honestly don't. Looking for trouble because I'm more than happy to be of service. Yeah, I'll probably end up beating the crap out of you beforehand, but hey ho. Doesn't look like there's anything else here. Okay, we're good on those two. Um, anything else? Salt's here. It's always Did wise you know to what loot. Lizzie Fitzroy and her anarchist cronies want for you? <laughs> uh, Strut, they say. Uh, throw down your tools, they say. Why, I tell you, the moment you do, you oh, will wow, see this is where the, um, they do the vending machines, I guess. Not where we want to be. Don't you see what the vast popular is selling? They're selling dreams. And dreams, my friend. Uh, they don't okay. come cheap. Oh, I see. I see shiny. Oh, I can't grab that. Right, I think I actually, yeah, I know where we need to go now. So we need to go this way. We need to go on board this ship here on our left, and then get off. Gotta say, if we need to shoot our way out, we're cooked. It's not gonna be, uh. It's gonna be very ugly if we have to shoot our way out. Hey there, how are you doing? Oh. There we go. I think we just uh, caused a ruckus. Looks like we're fighting our way out now. Uh oh. Whoops. I don't even know if that was worth it to be fair. So what are we gonna do? Knock my lights out. Come on, them, bro. Oh, pity. There we go. Well, <laughs> so much for um, making it under the radar.
Oh well. I wanted that stuff. <laughs> Hello there. You having a bit of an electric problem? Yeah, I, I sort of need those salts. <laughs> like instead of getting all the electric for the salts from that one guy, why don't we not just come here? Let's get here, loads of them. Right, open up the door. You wanna know what we do to pretty little stowaways? Or oh. maybe you don't. There she is. Hey! hey just just stop for a minute! Stay away! Where'd you go? I'm also trying to loot as well as we go. I don't really see anything now. I just want to talk to you. I said stay away. <laughs> Elizabeth. Just hold up for a stay minute. Away from me. I'm not stay angry away. with you. Hey, watch out. Move it. Move. No, no, no! No! Let me go! We got her! Oh shit. There's gotta be another way in. What is that? RPG? Oh god. Pick up this. They called Slate a monster and a traitor. I know the men who died in all of Heroes with Captain Slate. There is no shame to be counted in their number. The shame lies to we who assembled outside the hall. Though we were not the ones who fell, I feel only envy for those who perished under his banner. Okay. Sniper rifle. Okay, it probably means we're coming up against some long range enemies. Uh, this should be enough though. Got this too. We need it. Sounds like he's up there. She's up there. Sorry. He. She. And. Should be fine for a few minutes, right? While I loot. Out of ammo. Where is he? Oh, there. Holy moly. Thank you for finally dying. I'll you. Oh, you ain't gonna cripple anybody. Okay, got some salts there. Didn't really use any of my salts. Alright, where do we need to go? Somewhere over here. Skew Elizabeth. Where'd that one go? I swear. 
I hear a guy. I just no, oh, it's probably up here, any. I'm guessing she's through that door. Let's uh, grab all of this. Um, what you guys got for us? Um, we have enough of that, but um, sure, we still have enough of that one. We'll get that one. Keep going. Where'd you go? I lost her. I'm not gonna lie, I did lose her. This way? Oh, there she is. What? Oh. She just saved us. Hey, I'm slipping. Do not attempt to follow me, Mr. Dewitt. Elizabeth, I've made an arrangement to get our airship back. You can get us out of here. Yes, I just need to supply enough weapons to arm an entire uprising. And where will <laughs> we get these weapons? From one of our many friends and allies? A gunsmith in Finkton should be a walk in the park. What do you say, partners? <sighs> you're a liar, Mr. DeWitt. And a thug. But you're also my only means of reaching Paris. Thank you. Alright, time to start an uprising. Let's go. <laughs> Don't get too comfortable with my company, Mr. The Dewey. most common complaint I hear from the working man is that they are unhappy with their lot. Oh, why torment yourself, I ask? The ox can you open that, please? become a lion. And can you why open this? No, no. Thank you. Wants all those responsibilities Got it. and glory. You do your job, you eat your food. Go to sleep. Simplicity. Ah, uh, excuse me, trying to get out. You're not gonna attack me, are you? Good lad. Choose wisely. Now, Mr. Fink's a good man. You work hard, and I know he'll reward you. Um I guess we're going this way. I'm not really finding much kicking about though. You got anything interesting? No, I just want those guys. Right. Let's go this way. So all we need to do is arm a small uprising, and we get. Um, that would be your gunsmith. Who sent you to find this person? Daisy Fitzroy. She's either a great hero or the worst of scoundrels, depending on who's doing the telling. She's good for an airship. I don't care if she's the Queen of Holland. <laughs> yeah, she's got our only airship. Right, let's watch this. This way. Um. Oh, 
I am looking for loot opportunities too <laughs> as we go. Take the lockpick. The truth is, I don't have a lot of time for all that prophecy nonsense. I tell you, belief is, is just a commodity. And old Comstock, well, he does produce, but like any tradesman, he's obliged to barter his product for the earthly ores. You see, one does not raise a barn on How are we going to get into Finkton? Illegally. Let's look for another way in. A pink hammer and Fink's hand to swing it. <laughs> he needs me. Lest he soil his own. Yep, that's our last five lockpicks. Right, okay, I think I said health, right? Yeah. Feel better already. And haven't used a ball of our damn lockpicks. Now if that door like has like less lockpicks on it, like if I go around and it's like, oh yeah, this was only cost like one, I'm gonna be Okay, good. Didn't have anything on it. <laughs> Alright. Guess we're going this way. Fink Industries is not recruiting so at this time. Please come going in. this way. Seems right up your alley. Good, this one doesn't cost any lockpicks. All done. Over there, a service elevator. We should take us down to Fink. And get ourselves killed in the bargain. I always find that in this game, lockpicks are always a, um, they're in massive short supply. Either I'm looking in the wrong area for them, or. Can't be having haven't found anything. How are you still alive? Give yourself a Take your money. Need money? Sure. Thank you. Well, that could have went a lot better. We're running low on ammo again. Nothing like running low on ammo. Salt. Gunsmith Chen Lin wanted for known connections to the outlaw Daisy Fitzroy. Looks like our guy's drawn attention. Nope. Okay, no. we're running super low on a lot of things currently. I wasn't expecting to get into a massive gunfight like that either. And let me guess, I can't open up this. Yeah. Requires one lockpick, are you joking? You've got to be joking. One lockpick. I don't think you can buy lockpicks either, can you? Health salts. Nope. Oh, that would have been so nice to open that though. Oh. Um. Okay, that RPGs. That is. Okay, that's only 400, so sure, we'll buy that. Um. Oh, damn it. We're just out of money for that. That was going to be a good upgrade, too, but 
Run out of money. I am looking around for an, a lockpick. Oh, purse. Money. I'm not sure if that's just taking us over the, um, what we need or not. Excuse me. Found some money. Cash. Oh, yeah. Hmm. The audio diary. I hold in my hand the private journal of Comstock's wife. It puts the lie wow. to this miracle child nonsense. She loved the child not. It seems the sainted lady would have preferred to let the seed of the prophet just dry out on the bed sheets. Take a look at this lock. There we go. We found one more lockpick to open Got up it. this. Now we've got no lockpicks again. <laughs> now I'm pretty sure now I can buy my upgrade I want to buy. My gun. And there's my dodgy ass controller. <laughs> uh yeah, clip increase on this thing. That'll be great. Thank you. Okay, that's all we can afford though. Alrighty. Uh it's like sure where we need to go now. The hyena is a trickster. They live to stir up trouble. So you beware the hyena. Oh, they right will here. leave you with naught but the sound kind of, of their laughter. Oh, nice. There's another lock pick. Sweet, thank you. Alright, let's press the button. Alright, here we go. It's Slate's locker. He must have worked here. Uh, this is my mother's diary. Why would Slate have it? My husband claims the child was created from whole cloth by divine will. I am a believer, but I am not a fool. His bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother. She had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please. Yeah, let's get out of here. All aboard the creepy ass elevator. Jeremiah Fick, and I want to share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee. Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee. Be the bee. Gotta imagine uh, every time you come down this elevator, you gotta listen to that. Oh, hello. Um, hello. Mr. Dewitt. Uh, yes. Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? Dewitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top. <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. You think? Well, the man's got an ego. <laughs> you think? You think? Oh, there goes my dodgy controller walking us forward again. I need to hurry up and get this controller in. I really do. Hopefully it'll be here sometime soon. It's like, randomly walking forward like that is it's really starting to get on my nerves. Can't even put the controller down for a minute. Now, some say to me, think, why is it that we get paid in tokens that are only good at the company store? Well, I'll tell you what, I'll be damned if I let any of you poor folk get robbed at some shady establishment. You see, 
The Fink Company store brings you Fink products at a price designed specifically for the Fink worker. Mr. DeWitt, welcome to Finkton. You'll find a variety of supplies here that should see you through your visit. A lockpick, a pistol. What does Mr. Fink want with us? Excuse me, miss, but Mr. Fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman. But why- So sorry, young miss, but any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with Mr. Fink directly. Does this strike yeah. you as good news? No. It doesn't strike me as good news. What do you think? Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies by the clock shop? Scavenge supplies by the clock shop first. Where's the clock shop? Eight minutes speed, now eight. Seven and a half. Seven and a half. Six minutes, minutes and fifteen seconds. Six minutes and five. Five minutes fifty. I, I could do five and fifty. Five and fifty. I said five and fifty. Anyone know that five and fifty? Okay, I want us to go that way. I'm not exactly sure where this clock shop is, which you speak of. Now, Jeremiah Fink has a philosophy. You see, a company is like. Right, and I just did look at the time and figure out how long we've been going at in this episode. How many? Thank you. You have the cow, the one pick. How many picks we got? Two. Now they provide meat, milk, and labor. <laughs> then, well, there are the hyenas. Sure. Open it. The troublemakers who only serve to rile up the cow. Done. Thank you. Here's the clock shop she was on about. Oh, sir. There's another cipher on it. Huh. So we need to find the code book? Yes. Looks like everything's been pounded at the Good Time Club. Maybe that's where we'll find it. Okay, at least we've got our lock picked back. Okay, we need to find the book to cipher that. I'm not seeing anything else. Alrighty, so I think what I'm going to do, guys, is um, I'm actually going to end this one here. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed this one. If you guys have, hit that like button. If you haven't, there's always a dislike button right next door to that. If you guys haven't hit that subscribe button already, hit subscribe and ring the little bell to be notified when I next upload. And I will catch you guys all in the next one. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, Morgan?